Welcome to the second training film, taking on great big old fat ships. Now first off, battleships, we can't kill them with just one bomb skip bombing and they put out just a hellacious amount of fire, so we've got to do something special. It's not just great big ships, but triple A ships such as the Naobi triple uh, A ship here, which is actually medium size, require special treatment. But we've got a plan for that. The technique we're going to use is called the double S. We're going to start well to the left of the ship, 1,500 feet, uh, dive down to about 1,000 feet, 300 miles an hour, keep your eye on the ship. When we start to shoot, we're going to cut hard right and dive right on down to the water. We'll actually be flying away from the ship. Now we're going to cut left, keep a steady dive down to about 50 feet, and we're going to start curling in towards him, climbing as we go. We'll be on top of the tracers when we release our bomb, and we'll climb as we cross over him, hook a left, keep the roll going, rise, and we're going to rise as we S away from him. Always S and away from him. Here's how it looks in external view against a big old battleship, which we're just going to annoy with our 1,000 pound bomb. Uh, again, we're starting about 1,000 feet, 350 miles an hour. We're going to roll it on over. This is the first part of that S coming down. Now his tracers are going to try to follow us and sometimes anticipate us. Here's the bottom of the S. Curling on in, release the bomb. And we're going up and down and then again up going left and then right. It's an S that's vertical and an S that's horizontal. His tracer is going to follow us around the entire time and he's not going to give us a touch unless he's really dang lucky. Here it is from the cockpit. We're going to go against a triple A ship here. Uh, once again here we are about a thousand feet going about 300-350 uh, miles an hour. Don't go too fast you can lock up your controls and then you're in a bad way. Now as soon as he starts to hiss, we're going to go ahead and curl on over. There's that roll. Coming along in sideways to him. We're going to curl on in again. Varying our altitude and stuff. We're looking for that sight picture. Relatively level. About 100 feet. 300 miles an hour. Nice release. Keep on curling away and curling away and curling away. And here we go. And I really like these ships because they uh, they burn. Now sometimes you'll get these ships with a thousand pound bomb and sometimes they'll just keep on a trucking. Uh, something you just gotta watch out for. Even if you get the ship, keep doing that double S because you never know what's going to happen or what's waiting for you on the other side. Uh, you might come out of that, uh, turn around and find out there's a big 109 G2 just waiting to pounce on you. Well, we've got the maneuver advantage. Chances are he came on high so he's going too fast. Uh, so we're going to build up some speed, keep maneuvering around. He's going to figure out that we're the pride of Soviet uh, naval fleet, and he might even just crash into the water, too afraid to even take us on. Happens that way. Give yourself a big old smile. We just figured out how to take on big old ships.